the new year and we are off to a very healthy start already all day long and it's going to continue. We are in the kitchen right now with not one, not two, but three different types of super smoothies with our super good friend, the awesome, the incomparable Catherine McCord. <laughs> well, <Welcome. laughs> And this is from your new book, Smoothie Project, yes. which, by the way, was was inspired because of your son's health issues. Yeah, so my son started getting headaches and nausea, stomach aches, uh, and this persisted for months. I was talking to doctors and nutritionists, couldn't figure it out. And I started to realize that every morning I was giving him pancakes and waffles and crepes. And when I started giving him a smoothie, he not only loved it, but his body got better within right. 28 days. So that's what it's all about. Wow. Food is thy medicine. Yeah. Medicine is thy food. Yes. Cameron Thank preaches this sure. every day, yeah. as does yeah. Tim I and Shirley. Yeah, I love it. And, too, yeah. and I love that you guys are getting to try yes. like exactly. smoothies. You know, back, new year, new year. That's right. Back to health. And Shirley basically grows all the things that we're putting in this Good, smoothie. good. We should team up <laughs> on supply. So we're starting with the super greens. Yes. Smoothie. So, so we're going to start with the super greens. So what goes in the super greens? Super greens. We're going to make this really fast and fun. That's the best part about making smoothies is like just dump it in. We've got cake. We've got cucumber. We've got this fresh ginger. Ginger Ooh. is great yeah, for your sure stomach. Um, mm -hmm. Celery. Nice. Just like really clean. Some sweetness with apple. And here, great tip. Put, especially if you have a high powered blender, keep the skin on. That's where that fiber is. And mentioning sure. skin with the lemon. Oh my gosh, the whole lemon. I know. Okay. De Debbie saw it earlier. She's like, wow. you're putting in the like the, the lemon rind? Okay. Take I'm out so the excited skin. about this. Yeah. And we were talking a little bit earlier the fact that when we use a juicer, yep. I, don't, I don't feel like I need the sweetness, but the fact that we're having using a blender instead, A, it's yeah. easier, Easy. B, um, you, you get all of that skin all and some of that roughage nutrients, in there. All those yeah. nutrients, and when my in-laws come to visit me in LA, this is always the smoothie that they want. They oh, love I it. Love that. And the fresh mint, this mm. is what gets oh, zip and zing. That's the secret ingredient. Secret ingredient. What about this guy? Oh, oh, why? Do we need liquid? Is that coconut right. water? We're going to add some <laughs> coconut water, but you could also do water, herbal tea. Amazing. You could use any kind of milk. Mm. So I really offer like the liquid that you want most. Okay. All right, let's just... move it up. Oh, wow. Get it ready, get it ready, get it ready. Oh Ooh, my gosh. That is very satisfying yeah. to see just be pulverized. Yes. Yep. Wasn't that fun? <laughs> and while oh you're doing that, gosh. I want you to pour that, and I'm going to get okay. some stuff over here. How is it, you guys? Amazing, delicious. Yeah. Mine is empty. Refreshing. Yeah, right. okay. <laughs> yeah. And then you garnish it? Yes. Yeah, so, well, I mean, you can. Like, all, you know, you can put anything that you want on top. Some I, of course, like to put, well, sometimes I like to put the fresh mint, but what I love about this is it gets nice and foamy on the Ooh. top. Yeah. And so it just tastes like something that, you know, we want people to feel good, feel full, but also so to know that you're doing something good for your body, having that, we were talking about the morning reset. Mm -hmm. So if you have a smoothie first thing in the morning, mm. you can high five yourself because you're like, it's mindfulness. I've already had a fruit, mm. a vegetable, and a protein. Yep. So like, I, yeah. right? I, I high five myself. This is delicious. Oh my gosh. And the lemon zest uh -huh. yeah. is amazing. What a great tip. Zip and zing, just keep it going. So All the, right, so next the next one. one. Yes, this is our crazy, healthy smoothie. <laughs> Which is hysterical, and I know it was inspired by your husband. That's right. actually so the name of the smoothie, crazy yeah. healthy. Mm -hmm. Crazy healthy smoothie, because my husband was working six to seven days a week, 16 hours a day. Oh. He was barely seeing you know, uh, his family. He wasn't exercising. And yet, when he walked out the door every day, he was like, at least I have my crazy healthy smoothie. Oh. And it yeah, really good. was sad, but yeah. he knew that it was the one thing he was doing that right. was good for, for his himself. body. So we've got some kale. And this Again, is a pared down version of what your husband was you doing. You can't, we were, Debbie and I were <laughs> laughing about that because it is definitely pared down. His version is literally like the whole counter Everything. smoothie. Oh um, I feel so, like he and John would be very good friends. Yeah. We were laughing John was about doing it. the same thing. He was putting everything in there, like Sweet. heads of broccoli, all kinds of things. And when I told him I felt it was a little too much, he said to me, you just don't want to be healthy. Uh -huh. I said, John, <laughs> there's and you everything out of the refrigerator and put it in there. Does John use a blender too or a yeah, juicer? This. A blender, yeah, see, okay. We like, we like blending because this is the, I'm glad you brought that up. Yeah. Fiber, fiber, fiber. Yeah. Keep That's your digestion good. going. Okay. You know, the book is really birthed to AARP. It's for babies don't need baby food. They should be, look, they had That's all true. this rainbow of food. Under. And as you get older, you want to be making sure that you're getting like the fiber in your body and all these incredible ingredients mentioning. Let me talk about this for a second. That's right. So we've got some beets, some bananas, some berries. Um, I want to talk to you guys about bee pollen. Uh, really, it's an immunity booster, especially yeah 
especially yeah. as we're getting sick at this mm -hmm. time of year, high in protein. And if you have allergies, yep. see if you have local bee pollen, it helps mm -hmm. with your seasonal allergies. A thousand percent. Um, wow. So these dates, which natural sweetness, make wow. sure to remove the that pit. Is... Pineapple, you can put in. Nice, well, frozen pineapple yeah, as well. Detoxifying. I like, so here's a good trick. Frozen cauliflower, frozen banana, great foods um, for really putting into smoothies because again, frozen cauliflower, you get a, a vegetable in there, but you don't taste it yeah. at all. So real trick, chia seeds. Let's talk about omega-3 fatty acids firing our brains. First thing in the morning, you want to be like, you know, going to work, going to school right. with these really good foods that are high in fiber. And, and again, same thing with And what was the other little thing you put in? Chia seeds, hemp seeds, and now mm. I put in some walnuts. Hemp seeds, and now some cocoa up milk uh, so we can and talking about milk plant-based you can use anything coconut soy milk almond milk um, pea milk or cow's milk you can sure. totally use if you don't have an you allergy like. and I would just like to brag about you for a minute because my good friend here knows what she's talking about Alexandra had has had eczema since she was born I've taken mm -hmm. her to every dermatologist under the Sun all the fancy ones here in Beverly Hills nobody could fix it Catherine said to me one day on the show cut dairy out and see if it works just do it for a few weeks since I cut the dairy out, her eczema went completely away. Wow, so I just really want to give you a big hug for that because I have to tell you something. that's what the Smoothie Project's all about. It's about healing your body with just yeah. good, real foods. Yeah. You know, we've all been, like, indulging through the holidays. It's time to just give a little morning reset. Should we pulverize? Let's go. Let's go ahead and hit it, Deb. Wow. wow. I, I know. Like, really? Hold on. You can even, if you want, pull it up. Stick your finger. And the book itself has 100 recipes, so everything from decadent to berry chapters to green chapters. Smoothies don't have to always, you don't have to be like, oh my god, I'm going to have a green smoothie right. every day. There is a variety for no matter what your tastes are. So Amazing. while I'm pouring this and giving Ooh. this to the counter, you tell Ooh. us about that final one, the detox. <laughs> yeah, so we have a detox smoothie also. Um, it has, again, f pineapple in it. So, mm -hmm. you know, especially when you're getting like sinusitis, you're, you're, like inflammation mm -hmm. in your face, in your body, we need to reset with a little detox smoothie great during the new year it's just you know it's important but I really encourage people to just find a smoothie that works for you that you really enjoy because that's what it that's what it's all about that's fantastic all about. yeah that's, that's what it's all right about you guys you keep blending over there yeah. <laughs> you're gonna love this one. Oh my gosh right. there we go crazy healthy is right Oh my gosh, I feel better already, everybody. For more from Catherine, be sure to grab a copy of her new cookbook, Smoothie Project, wherever books are sold. And as always, Ice cream. the full recipe for all this will be at hallmarkchannel.com. Thank you so much. Thank you, you so much. So